Hello. Welcome back to Tarot by Lodestone Productions, where we help you discover your true north. I am Aditi, and this is a message for whenever this message reaches you, because spirit is not bound to our time and space continuum. And so, the only time by which we tell time is divine time. Dig what I'm saying? Okay, so let us check our spiritual voicemail and see what is what. So let's go ahead and start with the Moonology Oracle deck. Let's see what they have to say about the matter. It's time to take action. It's time to take action. Hmm. Okay, let's, uh, new moon in Aries. Let's see what the book has to say with this. What does it say? Page 42 is the answer to everything. It is time to take action. New moon and Aries. The flame is lit. A wonderful new start beckons and you're on the right track. Drawing this card is a superbly positive sign that there is something you want to happen in your life. Take this card as a big yes from the universe. This is the time to really tune into your dreams. You may still have a long way to go. After all, Aries is the first sign of the Zodiac, but you're on your way. Determination, self-assertion and bravery are called for, but the hot fire of Aries is driving you towards success in whatever endeavor you're asking about. The caution, don't go too fast and forget your manners. Treat people well as you charge towards your goals. You'll create much better karma for yourself. Side note, don't even think about giving up. Don't even think about giving up. Mm. Additional meanings. Do your best to be happy with that. Avoid being brash right now. You need a 12 month plan in December. No way. A new male is coming into your life. Wookie. All right. 12 month plan. Okay. The book told you. Spirit has said it is time to take action. Have you got have you got have you got your journal for 2023 yet i haven't got my journal for 2023 yet i've been looking for them i've been looking for them but i haven't found the right one but it's it's time and i will also take this as um my own get with it and and get get my own poop in a group all right so time for some Time for some action. Time to take action. That's that's wonderful. So, what have you been letting? What have you been? What what's been sitting idle in your life? Hmm? What what you been? What you do? What you been doing? Hmm? What what you let? What have you let uh, gather dust? Yeah, I can think of a couple of things. Yeah, but, okay. Time to get off the sidelines, time to start playing. Get in the field. You know what, you thought that hard hat was just for kicks? Okay. All right, let's see what we have. Number one, the page of crystals. Okay, so 
A new idea? Hmm. New money. A uh, promotion. What else is here? Change, a change, a change. A change in your money. An upgrade. Upgrade in the dough. What else? Let's see. Oh, this is interesting. This, this is interesting. Let's see what. Huh. Okay. Let's see what the book has to say. I'm going to sit you over there for now. That's wow. One and two. Okay. Page of crystals. What information? Wands. The Page of Crystals is a bringer of new beginnings founded strongly in the material realm. They are calling for you to build on your professional or physical dreams, to start aiming for these goals. Be practical and be tactical. Okay. Okay. So, yeah. I'm going to sit you two side by side. Actually, I'm going to put you over here because... She looks like, bitch, you better work. All right. Let's put you two in the mix. And thank you, Spirit, for calling me to get the book. Because underneath the book, we have the Magician and the High Priestess sitting in the box. Go figure. All right. Shuffle this again. Hmm. That's okay. Practical plans. Your dreams need a practical plan. That's a card in the Moonology deck, I know for sure, but um, that's great. Thank you, Page of Pentacles, because that's some beautiful stuff. All right. So, Knight of Wands, Seven of Cups, High Priestess, the Devil. The Chancellor of Cups, Queen of Cups, and the Six of Wands. This is coming in quickly. This this fruition is coming in quickly. Um, And you're being called to do it, not just, not just because this showed up in the reading. Um, I truly believe that the reading was simply confirmation of some nudgings that have been happening. All right. Um, we've got the Seven of Cups and the High Priestess behind it. Um, this talks about like this is mm, fuzzy fluid the materialization process mm, going from concept to reality things are coming into focus thank you spirit things are coming in to focus yes because you've got this haze of the seven of cups you know, and it's, it's about, yes, we've got choices and it's all dreamy and, you know, that whole chestnut. But the high priestess actually, because she spends so much time 
in the ethers and in the spirit world like she the 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 fuzziness that throws off a meat suit is pretty basic for her right side note so long long time ago i think i was in junior high i was reading this interview with jackie chan and jackie chan talked about his upbringing his upbringing he wanted to join the chinese circus as a kid like he was like six years old right and so after you know much cajoling and all this stuff like he he actually joined the circus but he was away from his parents when he did it he was away from his foundation seven of cups while he was in the circus right and he said that one of the first things that they learned was how to walk on their hands and they would walk on their hands for hours and hours and hours right and the goal was for them to be just as uncomfortable upside down as they are right side up so what i'm seeing here to bring it back to the cards and these two here with the high priestess and the seven of cups she is just as comfortable in the fuzziness as she is in the physical world as is the devil the devil thrives in confusion smoke mirrors illusions that's kind of his jam right and depending on what the end goal is for the devil at this time uh, these illusions can he, he could set up these illusions to slow down this progress well what if you're wrong how many times have you felt this urge to jump up and do something and it didn't work out for you? And that, those, are the, those are the kind of thoughts that could creep up, especially when we're talking about allusions to the speed at which these prayers are being answered. Mm. So be mindful of the the traps that could be set up for you especially because things are so close so there's a higher chance of tomfoolery being afoot as you're nearing this goal and then we've got the chancellor of cups up next there is an inner knowing in you that is much much stronger than before i know this is like a, a regular occurrence this seems to be a theme that happens here at the page but it's a reoccurring theme because those are the strongest energies that are coming through there is a deeper knowing within you as individuals collective that is stronger than ever before and there is a serenity to this like that you that is just brand new to you like pop the tags on it brand new right there's this surety that only comes with that it's it's a surety that only comes when you are like tight tight with spirit like if you want that bullshit and you still all wishy-washy and you know then 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 there's the fucking turmoil but the, the queen of cups she's the, the turmoil she she it hits different with her 
it, it's different. It's different. When she's right side up, everything is gravy. Now, the Queen of Cups gets upside down. You can cancel Christmas, take a rain check on Easter, but that's not what we're dealing with right now. At all. And then we've got the Six of Wands here. It's victory, man. Like, it's, it's victory. I could, let me read this again. Let me read this again. Page 42. If there is something you want to happen in your life, take this card as a big yes from the universe. Take this card as a big yes, 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 yes from the universe. Six of Pentacles, yes, from the universe. Look, look at the picture. Look at the picture. Look at the picture. Hold up. Look, look at it. Yes. Okay. Why? Press, press down, shaking together, and running over. Ten of Daggers. Justice, Warden of Crystals, Eight of Crystals, Chancellor of Crystals. All right. So, yes, we are talking strictly about Shadow. Okay. Looks like this is going to be this. This is going to be a resources reading today. So with the Six of Crystals, um, this is having enough to be able to give to others and help others along the way. This is, make no mistake, this is not the giving of yourself so that you can go hungry. Like I said, good measure, press down, shaking together, and running over. Serving from your saucer as opposed to from your cup. Like when people talk about once they reach this certain this certain status in life and what kind of philanthropy they want to invest in I see that with like the six of crystals and then like actually starting to be able to do that thing where people dream of giving things away right because with the ten of daggers and there's you've learned so much from your time of not having the pain of having to do without and recognizing in those moments that you don't want to have it change you. One moment, please. Fighting that illusion, fighting that illusion tooth and nail. But the fact that you were able to pull your face out of the dirt 
and pull those daggers out of your back and say but spirit you're not done with me yet spirit says no no I'm not I'm not I'm not done at all um, I know this hurt I saw it I saw it I hurt with you this dagger right in the middle of her chest I hurt with you having to witness you go through all of this pain let me um, let me go ahead and set this right because yeah you didn't let the lack change you and now now you are the queen of your own resources the queen I tell you because you knew how to do without let's see what you can do with you've shown that you can handle that level of responsibility now it's time to see things grow we've got the eight of crystals right behind that and uh, yes you are learning how to hone and refine your skills you are taking the time to learn new ways of resource management as well as resource growth he resource growth and you are perfecting that so much so that not only are you able to make things grow you're able to spot the potential in things that haven't yet sprouted anything something out of nothing something out of something and perfecting the two. Page of Wands, Three of Wands, the Tower, nice. Five of Cups, mm -hmm. Lovers, and the Ten of Cups. I cannot. Spirit, you just, again with the hee hees. Okay. So, not only is our money about to make a change, our, 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 our personal lives are also about to go through a metamorphosis with this page of wands, three of wands, tower trifecta going on over here. So the page of wands, it's about being in the moment savoring the moment for everything that it is because in this moment is where the real magic happens and there are so many things going on in this tiny window of time but there's so much happening that if you allow yourself to fully appreciate all the things that are happening in the moment, you will stretch out time. And as you are appreciating the moments for what they are and showing that actual gratitude your spirit is ushering in those very things that you have asked for. See, spirit has already said yes. Now spirit is about to show you yes. With this tower. This tower is burning down this collection of homes that are dilapidated beyond repair if been put together just kind of haphazardly you know there's been a lot of work put into it but there's just it's just too much work to try and keep it going you know it's just it's it's too much just you know it's set it on fire get the insurance money and start over 
but I spent so much time on the tower. Yeah, yeah, you did. And you know what? It was falling apart. You don't need to hang on to this, the Five of Cups. You don't need to hang on to any of this. It did the things that it needed to do. Hold on. It did the things that it needed to do. You learned what you needed to learn with this with this tower okay you you put in the sweat equity you have cried the tears necessary to keep this thing going as long as it needed to keep going now it's time to turn it loose no sense of crying over spilled milk why because now that everything is cleared out you are able to see what is really important your heart is no longer preoccupied by keeping all of this stuff up and running and, and I use that I use that term loosely because looking at the condition of this tower wasn't a whole lot up and running over here it was a hot mess and it needed to come down it was a tall hot mess and it needed to come down but look when it does when it does after all of this is washed away and you have shed your tears and now now that you have released the weight of all of these expectations that have been heaped upon you and now that you are free and clear you are open to receive actual love into your life and it's the healthy kind it's the healthy kind not some hallmark tomfoolery but like the real deal how nice is that man like super great jeez okay and here we go chancellor of wands seven of crystals two of cups knight of daggers four of crystals and four of daggers. I know you want to do it yourself, Chancellor of Wands. I know that you are fully capable of handling all of this on your own. But you know what? You don't have to. You don't have to. Because then, you, because when you, when you feel like you have to do it all yourself, there are certain things because you've got so many irons in the fire seven of crystals not all of them are going to catch like they need to so in doing this and because you're so invested in all of these things that you want all of them to bear fruit and you want it you you just want to bat a thousand when everything you put your, you want the Midas touch everything you touch turns to gold thing about the Midas touch is everything that you touch turns to gold we saw how that turned out for him it wasn't the blessing that he thought it was going to be yeah? Yeah. okay moving on so uh, with the two of cups you don't have to do it by yourself come on spirit you don't have to do it by yourself spirit is actually going to bring somebody into your life that is able to take some of these burdens off of you because the first thing you did look look you got look 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 the burden was removed from you 
and I'm pretty sure that this looking back on all of this is looking back on somebody else's child somebody else's responsibilities that you took upon yourself to do leaving your own responsibilities just to kind of flop about in the wind well these flopping responsibilities are very well could be these crystals that need to be pruned empty way because they're getting in the way of the big crystals getting the nutrients that they need and you're going to need to preserve the good ones four of crystals come on spirit you're going to need the big ones so allow the knight of daggers to come in and help you prune these bushes oh side note shave so allow the Allow the, oh my God, allow, allow the, shit, allow the Knight of Daggers to come, dang it, and help you prune these bushes. So that you can really see, number one, what you're working on. It just keeps getting better. So that you actually see what you're working with and you you know what to set aside and what to release with the Four of Daggers. Take the time, take the time to clear your mind and create your plan. Create your plan while you have time, while you are not running around trying to fix the money pit and while you are clearing things out and while you have the energy to be able to do things for yourself, then do things for yourself. For you, simply for your own enjoyment, simply for your own growth, simply for your own coronation. Do things for you and only you. on getting that 12 month plan together yeah okay thank you for taking the time to hang out with me today and remember until we meet again to be good to yourselves and to each other and I will see you next time bye now